everyone welcome back to my channel my name is Rachel Ray and today we're going to do a thankful Thursday this is kind of a video where I show you things that subscribers have sent me or that I've ordered myself and in this case there's only one thing that I actually ordered for myself and I'm gonna save this till the end this is my very beautiful diamond painting pen that was custom made by James Clevenger over on the Facebook group crafters anonymous with mrs. crochet and coffee and Rachel Ray uh, that's my boss pen and I am really excited to get into it but first I want to share with you all the stuff that other people have given me over the past few weeks so I'm going to start with this little letter I just got this teeny tiny little envelope in the mail and if you know me it's really hard for me to get into stuff so let's see who this is from Oh, look at the little puppers. How cute. Sorry about the uh, lighting today as well. It's going to be a little bit warmer because I had to close my blinds. Oh, it's Cal. To Rachel, thank you for your support. I really appreciate all the help and support you've given me. And thank you for being my friend. Love and hugs, Cal. Thank you, Cal. Oh, that is so adorable. I'm going to put it right over here so I can see it every day. Thank you so much, Cal. I really appreciate that. And it's no problem at all. I love, 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 love helping you out all the time. <laughs> Sorry, hubby came in. Um, yeah, no, Cal, of course, I'm always going to help. No, anytime anybody needs help, just reach out. Um, another good thing to do would be to join the group Crafters Anonymous with Mrs. Crochet and Coffee and Rachel Ray, because everybody can help you then. <laughs> and you won't have to wait for an answer, but love you, Cal. Um, the next thing is I got really confused because it had Rachel Ray, but then it had my real address and I thought that maybe it was from my mom, you know, because mom, but, um, it wasn't, I'm pretty sure that this is from Pippa and you have to see this. It is the most adorable pastel stripey llama and it's so soft you guys. It's so cute. Thank you so much. I love all the little animals. <laughs> I'm not really like a, this is, oh, it's an alpaca, alpaca so <laughs> cute. Um, I'm not really a stuffy person, but these are so adorable. Can't help it. <laughs> um, I would love to enjoy it as long as I can and then maybe bring it to a children's hospital or something like that. Um, because this seems safe enough as long as it's a child that's over what three for these beaded eyes I don't really know but um so cute so soft so adorable if you're into like I'm a, I'm a tactile person <laughs> I like touching things uh, it calms me down for my anxiety so um, if you are also like that I don't know where she purchased this maybe she could tell us in the comments Pippa if you're watching um, because it's so cute I'm pretty sure this is what she sent me. I'm a normal. <laughs> okay, so thank you so much for that. Let's put you over here a little bit. And I'll put the... Here, you stay there and watch over us. The next thing that came in was a Zox bracelet, which I love Zox. Um, Mrs. Coffee got me into it. As I'm sure she got a lot of other people into it. Uh, Zox is just like a uplifting wristband company bracelet company let's see what i got sent i'm just checking the bag so let's see Ooh. oh wait i ordered this did i or did i no <gasps> somebody sent me this oh how beautiful today i will not worry Take a deep breath and rest your tired mind. Relax. The unknown may seem scary now, but take a moment to recognize how much you've been through already. You're bigger than this. You're strong enough to handle it all. Have faith, my dear. Everything will be all right. Oh, I'm sorry about my dirty thumbnail in that shot. Oh, look. That's beautiful. I love those roses. And on the inside it says, today I will not worry beautiful love it no that couldn't have been me that couldn't have been me that ordered it thank you so much to whoever that was it doesn't say on the envelope um 
I guess I got ink on my thumbnail. You'll have to forgive me. And then the last one, I don't know. Uh, where did I put the thingy? Did I put it in the trash? Uh, it says it's from J-E-E-G-L-I from New York. So I'll have to go and look and see if I can find out who that is. Oh my goodness. Um, here we go. Try to open this bag up without cutting it. Okay. Come on now. I don't want to hurt myself. <laughs> Ooh. goodness it's a floor stand no way oh my goodness gracious look at this the universal craft stand easily holds scroll frames round or oval hoops and stretcher bars that are sold step separately so you just clamp it in here at the top oh my gosh thank you so much whoever sent this to me I really really appreciate that Holy cow, I know what I'm going to do tonight. <laughs> cool. Ooh, I really hope that it works with my recliner. And even if even if I can't recline, I could still sit in the recliner. That's amazing. Check that out. It just sits on the floor like that. It looks so good because it's wooden. It's from Frank A. Edmonds Company. I've never seen this one, but thank you so much. Oh my goodness. That's amazing. I can't wait to try it. Let's, let's just look inside really quick. I'm sure that it'll take a bit of finagling, but I promise I'll read the instructions. I always say that, you know me. So there's loads of wood there and we've got some parts. And we've got more pieces of wood down in there. I don't know if you can see that. And there is a booklet. Come on. There we go. Oh, that looks complicated. <laughs> that looks a little complicated. Okay. Let's see. Open. Ooh, okay. Okay. I think this might take two people. <laughs> I like to look at these diagrams. Um, and maybe my husband will help me put it together. We'll see. Thank you so much. Yay. I really appreciate that. Um, if for some reason that was a screen name and not, you know, and but you're you want me to give you recognition just let me know you could always email me and let me know that it was you because at the moment it's just a little confusing but I'm gonna leave it like that so that I can put it together later tonight Yay! okay so next up we have the pen from James Clevenger who's in the group um, and this this right here uh, which I can show you in my this uh this is actually um customs fees so can you see goods imported from outside the eu with a value over 22 euro for vat purposes and 150 euro for import duty purposes are sus suspect subject mm -hmm, to customs charges import duty is calculated on the customs value of a consignment though customs value is the cost of the goods plus postage packaging and insurance and VAT is calculated on the custom value plus any import duty amount. So, yeah, this is why I don't order a lot from the states because if they if they write if the value is written down as more than twenty two euro, then it gets flagged and then I have to pay extra charges. But James is worth it for his pins. Totally worth it, and I'm so excited. I hope you're excited too. Um, here is his card. Well, if you want to check him out, this is his phone number as well. But ladies, he's he's taken, so you know. Uh, but you can check him out on blackwolfwoodworks.com, 
and on Facebook and Instagram, bringing warmth and beauty to your home one piece at a time. <gasps> I'm so excited. Okay, let's get into it. Let go. Thank you so much, James, for indulging me. I went to him and said, listen, like ever since I started collecting pens, there's one type of pen that I've always wanted, which is a moss pen. And he was more than happy to oblige me in creating a moss pen. And he even was able to make more than one blank and sell those as well. So there are a few other people in the world that have a pen that's very similar to my own. Get rid of that. Oh, goodness. <laughs> well, it's packaged really, really well. Okay. Which is awesome. Oh, guys, 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 guys. I'm so excited. There's two of them in here, so I don't know what to expect. <gasps> Woo! Okay, so this is the first one. Oh gosh, you're not gonna be able to see this. I'm gonna have to get footage outside and put it in here. <gasps> so in the group, when he was doing his testing, he poured a load of moss into this pen uh, and gold glitter because the live during the live stream, people were saying, oh, I'll put in the gold glitter. Ooh, that feels so cool. Thank you so much. It's a little like rough because of the moss, but it looks really cool. Can't wait to go outside and um, turn this around in the sunshine for you so you can see. That's excellent. Whoops. And then this is the, uh, this is the, this is the one. <gasps> oh my goodness. Okay, I'm going to do the same outside, but first... Can we just appreciate how cool that is? So he put in purple on both ends because my favorite color is purple, of course. And I think that it works really well if the center is clear so you can really see that moss. Oh my gosh. And I love the shape. I really do. I watched him turn this pen. Well, actually, did I watch him turn this pen live too? No, I think I was late for this one. But this one, I watched him do it live and it was so fun to watch. Oh my gosh. And it's so smooth as well. Like super duper smooth. <gasps> so pretty. That is so cool. I chose moss. You're probably wondering like, why moss? I chose moss because um, I really, I, I enjoy nature and moss is a huge part of living in Ireland. <laughs> uh, it's very wet here. So a lot of um, our nearby parks and stuff, there's some incredible mosses. Um, yeah, so I just, I chose moss. Now I love the flower pens and um, especially, I love the um, seashell pens. You can get seashell pens, but they're incredibly difficult to turn and it's hard to find someone who is up to the challenge because it really damages their tools. So you probably have to pay a buttload to, um, excuse my language, to get it done. But um, the prices were super fair. I purchased the moss myself and had it sent to him and he happily obliged. Each and every individual pen is unique because he he turns them to whatever the blank is calling. So you can see that the shapes are different, the bottoms are different on these pens, but I think they're absolutely stunning. Thank you so much, James. I really, really appreciate it. Thank you for indulging me. I think that these these are just going to be treasures in my collection for a long, long time to come. Please check him out over on Facebook or on his website um, or Instagram. If you're an Instagram person, I am super, super chuffed about this. Um, and yeah, that's that's all I really have to share with you guys today. Thank you so much for joining me. Um, I am very happy with all the things that you sent me as as always you never have to feel pressured to send me anything um i'm but i i do i do really appreciate it when people think of me and they send me things my post office box details are down in the descriptions of my videos but you i mean honestly it's fine I just love that you watch the videos, that you comment and you connect with me in some way. And 
this has been incredible and I do appreciate it. So thank you all so much <laughs> for watching this video. <laughs> if, if you, uh, if you're new here and you'd like to subscribe, there's a little subscribe button just down here and then there's a bell next to it. And if you hit the bell, you'll be notified when I upload new videos and when I occasionally go live and do some diamond painting or some stitching together. I'd love to have you join me. Uh, please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and I will see you all in tomorrow's video. Take care, everyone. Bye!